Hello aspirants, welcome to Ekam IS Academy. Today we are going to discuss about Shanghai Cooperation Organization which was in news because its recent summit started commencing in Kazakhstan's capital Astana. So let's look into what is Shanghai Cooperation Organization, what is its relevance for India and which is a country that is becoming the newest member in SEO. All these are the things which we are going to see in this short and crisp video. Without any further delay, let's see. So first thing you have to keep in mind, this year's head of the state a summit of SEO is being held in the country of Kazakhstan, which is having the capital as Astana. With respect to this, you have to keep in mind, this is one of the Central Asian country along with other countries like Uzbekistan, Kyrgyzstan, Turkmenistan and Tajikistan. All these are called five Central Asian countries and do keep in mind, here we have an important water body called RLC. This is recently so much in news because of its shrinking size and all. So RLC has only border with Kazakhstan and Uzbekistan. That is also important from examination perspective. And if you see Kazakhstan also have a border with Caspian Sea along with Turkmenistan and Iran. So these are the things and you have to keep in mind these are all the countries which have formed or independently formed after the disintegration of USSR and we also have India and Central Asian relations started from 1991 onwards. So this is what we have to keep in mind. Then we also have to keep in mind with respect to Kazakhstan that India had uh, nuclear supplies deals or agreements with Kazakhstan which is also helping us in importing our uranium which we require for our nuclear energy generation. So without any other this uh, so now let us look into what is SCO and what is its relevance for India. So first thing is Astana is holding the Shanghai Cooperation Organization's recent summit of 2024 and this is the 24th summit of SCO since its inception. So first thing you have to keep in mind what is SCO. SCO is a political, economic and military organization of Eurasian countries, economic, military organization of Eurasian countries. Eurasian means it is having members from both Europe as well as Asia. So initially it was established as a five member grouping called Shanghai Five. Shanghai Five. So what are all those five countries? They are Russia, China, Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan and Tajikistan. So these are the initial five countries which have formed the Shanghai Five with respect to political, economic and military cooperation. Then what happened to this? Another country joined as a sixth member that is Uzbekistan. Later after this country joining into SCO, the present grouping of SCO has emerged from Shanghai, Cooperation, Shanghai Five as Shanghai Cooperation Organization. Then when did India join is? India has joined in 2017 Astana Summit. In the same place where the present summit is being held, there itself when the previous summit was held in the year 2017, then India along with Pakistan were admitted as the newest members into SCO. That means along with the six countries, these two also became the new countries to join SEO. Like that it became eight member grouping by the year 2017. But in the recent times another country also have joined SEO as the ninth member that is Iran. So this is what you have to keep in mind. Then where is this headquartered means it is headquartered in the country of China in its capital Beijing. Beijing is the place where SEO is being headquartered. Then you also have to keep in mind SEO also have different organizational setup like heads of the state council is there. There is also a council among the external affairs or foreign affairs ministers and also most importantly you have another organization called RATS, Regional Anti-Terror Structure. RATS is there to negotiate between many member countries with respect to terror and anti-terror measures. So how to stop terrorism and how to better the anti-terror measures and how to increase anti-terror surveillance in the country. So all these are also part of RATS is also part of SEO. Then we also have to keep in mind what is the relevance of SEO. If you see the most important member countries of SEO are Russia and China. So these are seen as the countries which are trying to 
oppose western domination so on the one side in case if you want to enhance your relations towards russia and china this serves as a better platform to deepen our relations with both the countries of russia and china so this is seen as a reaction against western domination by some other experts then another thing you have to keep in mind is seo is not only increasing india's relations with asian countries like china and central asian countries but it is also promoting our relations with europe as well as asia this is another advantage that india had then another thing you have to keep in mind is it is also increasing our relations with respect to central asian countries because major or major central asian economies or countries are also part of this grouping so this also enhances our ties with central asian countries in this way seo as a grouping also has been playing an important role in india and its foreign policy then what is the important thing we have to keep in mind is seo has two languages as official languages one is chinese as well as russian then what is the practice question given for the day which of the following countries is not founding member of shanghai cooperation organization among the whatever the given options choose the correct one and try to put your answer in the comment section then as we have reached the end of the video today i have discussed about what is seo summit where it was being held and recently if you have remembered last year india also hosted the seo summit but it was in the virtual mode india that is was the first time when it has hosted both g20 summit in offline and also in seo summit that was held by india on virtual basis so this is another in interesting and important fact which you have to keep in mind and in this particular summit there is a high chance that belarus is going to be accepted as the 10th member country into seo so it is very much important as brics as a grouping is also having increased membership or it is expanding its membership you also have to keep in mind seo is also increasing its membership and it is trying to exert more and more influence in the regional as well as international affairs it is having a very important role to play in geopolitics as well as strategic importance so this is all with respect to this video if you find the video useful please let me know in the comment section thanks for joining us all the very best